Did you see um, this Texas situation going on with this young white kid going up to a black family's door with a whip? And he just starts swatting at the door. Yo, oh, that fool's not dead. What the yeah. fuck? Is it? It's kind of a crazy story behind. It's you. a crazy story. So this little white kid, oh, this man, little white kid, on, starts whipping the door. The mom opens the door. She goes, "You better get out of here with that whip." And then the kid doesn't say nothing, and he just like walks away. How old was the kid? Like single digit age. Did they not catch him on like ring or something? Yeah, yeah they got him on the ring cam. So where does he get a whip from? You know? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Right, where did mom's you store? The whip store? Like, what is it? Casual, your casual yeah, toys. Yeah. Mom, I'm getting whipped at home with that. It's <laughs> <laughs> one with the tassels. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, so they end up going outside. They see that he also may have scratched their car with it because oh, he was shit. like whipping oh. shit on the way to the <laughs> Indiana Jones. Yeah, yeah. So that's what go, I hope it is. They go to the the white boy's house with the white family, and it's uh, the the black dad is there, and he's like, "Yo, your son, boy, get out of here right now!" And then the white dad comes out with a gun, like holstered, oh. and he's like, "Well, uh, my boy says that your boy jumped him the other day." And then they're like, hey, that can't be true because our boy's 13, doesn't even go to the same school. Yeah. Like, they just think it's the most ridiculous thing. And then the dude fires like a warning shot, oh, like next to him. So they fucking shoot the roof and stuff? Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's worse than that. It's worse. His little daughter was so close to it when he shot it. Oh, she didn't get God. hit. Oh, his shit. own daughter. His the own guy? daughter, yeah, his own daughter. Oh, so he behind. shoots a warning shot oh, behind him. Dummy, bro. So then he gets arrested. Family not that smart, huh? Yeah. yeah. And now that guy is, is currently in custody, I believe. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Where was the warning shot? Like next to the girl's ear? Yeah. No, I think I think, he, I think he fucked up. I think he just yeah. like was gripping it or something like that. And just like no, not good trigger was, control. Doing that whole get off my property, and then the it was funny because when the black dad like stepped back, he like accidentally stepped on some flowers, and he's like, "You stepping on my flowers!" Like, <laughs> <laughs> like as if it was like a malicious like. <laughs> Like he didn't just pull out a gun, oh and the dude was like, God. "Yo, what the fuck?" He was like waiting for like a reason. He's like, "My geraniums, <laughs> my geraniums." Yeah, so that's the situation now, and they they don't know if it was true that some kid got jumped or what anything. The but fuck. some kids need to get spanked, man. <laughs> but and he had know, a whip. He, at but the you door. know, but look, that goes right back to the parent. Yeah. That's that's what you it is. Yeah. 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 Ignorant the parent is, bro. It's like, dude, you're gonna have a lot of ignorance, and people get like, "Oh, race." You're not gonna ever. You're not gonna ever get rid of it. You're gonna always have people who are gonna be ignorant like that and do stupid stuff or say stuff. And you teach your kid that because kids don't know yeah. black and white. Yeah. I didn't even know I was really black, bro, until I moved to Texas and went to school and I got jumped when I lived in Galveston by some white kids calling me. I was like, damn, what is that? Damn. You know, fighting and shit, getting jumped. Yeah. And another black kid said, hey, man, watch out. These kids, blah, 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 they're race. I'm like, what is that? I didn't even know I was black. How old are you? Mm. First grade. Wow. First grade? First grade. Shit. I got jumped. I got jumped by some kids on the way home. But then the apartment complex I lived in, one of my best friends was a little white kid, no, you know, a little dirty white kid, and we were buddies. <laughs> <laughs> a little dirty white kid. <laughs> you know, don't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you know, you know, you know, kind. You know, right around. Piece of hay. Yeah. <laughs> you know, we used to play out there little. Banjo. We used to play NASCAR. You know, a little push cars around yeah. and stuff. But he's my little buddy. But his, I never heard his mom say the word in word or yeah. his, his dad. You know, and they were they were straight like you know. I'm in Texas, Galveston, hillbillies. Mm -hmm. You know, I mean, it's country. Yeah. We're, we're not rich either. We're poor, living in a little, little dirt, little apartment complex. But so it's not everybody. But you're gonna have ignorance, and some people are just yeah. ignorant. And you gotta blame the parents, right? Look that's at the dad. The He's a fucking idiot. Come on. <laughs> yeah, bro. I mean, that's, <laughs> there's your example fly. right there. Yeah. He was probably paranoid, man. He's scared as fuck. He probably told his kid to go do that shit. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> Honestly, because exactly. why would the kid leave? The, where do you go get the whip from? Yeah, exactly. It's not just sitting over. I mean, obviously, yeah. take this, go it into them. Oh, yeah. oh, more black people house. And go start whipping some shit. I'm telling you, boy. <laughs> Teach yourself, boy. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna show them. Yeah. Goddamn, we're gonna show them. He's like, all right. Yeah. They're gonna learn okay. today who Jeffro is. Jeffro. <laughs> <laughs> we have a six shooter ready. Yeah, yeah. yeah so Bring him back knows, here, man. boy. Lead him back. Lead yeah. him back. <laughs> Lead him back. We're gonna rank. You got it. Hey, low key. Yeah. Kind of a crazy theory, yeah, but like, man. could be I mean, true. Well, yeah, it is. It's crazy. Sounds like I've heard it before, though. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds like it happened. Yeah, the old bait and switch. Yeah. Yeah, you yeah, know, bring the bait out there, boy. It's just Get a like, bait. It's, okay. it's just yeah. a more creative bait. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> a kid with a whip. Like he's like, yeah. How do I do it? Do I this? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You know, like they do with the hold down, yeah. man. Let me be really, what do you do, little kid? Uh, uh, but you know what I mean? Yeah. The, how do they know to do that? Yeah, crazy. They know oh, to do man. that. I didn't even so have a horse. He has a whip. Yeah, exactly. 
Yeah, and they and then the, again, the, when the cops came to uh, investigate, they didn't confiscate the whip, and a bunch of people were mad about that. <laughs> <laughs> like, they didn't let them keep the whip. Yeah, <laughs> put in evidence. Yeah, evidence. <laughs> that's, that's evidence. I think they were more fucking like concerned about the gunshot. Imagine they don't go right back to the whip. What about the whip, though? <laughs> he had a gun with the whip. See that right there? Who? Gun yeah. versus whip. So that right there is right? bring oh, back yeah. memories. I don't know. Yeah. I've seen a lot of movies where the whip beat the gun. <laughs> <laughs> where they go? Right here. Yeah. Oh my finger. Which one is the more lethal oh, weapon, man? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Depending on who's the So it could have been a case of mistaken identity, maybe, that they thought, you know, that, or that boy thought that that kid was the one who jumped him, so he went to the wrong house. Yeah. I don't know. But that's just bad parenting, too, though. It's bad parenting, for sure. It's also a terrible way to, like, be responsible for your kid when they show up. They're just like, oh, let me escalate the situation yeah, with a exactly. gun. <laughs> let me make this even worse. Yeah, yeah we had, a, um, you know. like, an HOA Halloween party uh, uh, in our community. And then like all the parents are hanging out and all the kids are hanging out and then there's like this little like, I don't know, like 11 or 12 year old white boy running around with like this random hammer that's part of his oh, costume. Oh. Uh, it's like, it's soft though. Oh, it's like a real hammer. No, it's like a soft <laughs> hammer. Well, and he's costume? whacking all the kids. Oh. And he's whacking all the kids and then like me, my, uh, my wife Gio, and my other friend Silent Mike, we're just standing there like, man, this kid's a fucking nuisance. And he's going around and then so Mike, he's just friendly so he's like, I'm just gonna play with the kids and maybe like establish some order. And then this guy comes and he starts whacking him, the mic on the head too. Boing, 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 boing. And then so I was like, oh, I gotta like put a stop to this. So I was like, I did it in a play way. Mm -hmm. I was like, you're under arrest. So I grabbed the hammer, I ripped it out of his hands, and I put him on the ground like this. And then he was like, <laughs> and, then, and then Jill's like, citizens arrest. Jill's like, you can't be doing that. He's like, he's he's white. And I was like, no, nah, at this age, minorities are. Like, <laughs> I got all the voice in the world. <laughs> I got a seat at the HOA. Yeah. Now, where were the kids' parents yeah. at? So, like, uh, in the beginning, we would, like, try to, like, move our whole group so that the uh, the kids move over, and then you see the kid. Um, well, like, hammer kid? Would be, yeah, hammer kid would be in the view of the mom. And when the mom would see him, he'd just, just be like, oh. The oh, fact that you have like to that, even do like that, that, like yeah. that you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're trying to like like subtly like go, hey yeah. man, you're fucking kids. Try to nudge her into parenting a little yeah, bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But she's just like, oh, there he goes again. It's just crazy. I don't know what crazy to do. Crazy little Toby with his hammer. Yeah. Yeah. But see, like you said, you got her, and then her, where's her man at? He's probably some dude eating a, 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 a vegan burrito. <laughs> You know what I mean? Great weenie, vegan burrito. <laughs> a little weenie, bro. Oh, that's a deduction. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, estrogen out, you know what yeah. I mean? Don't know how to stop the kids. Because the kid is running the household, oh, it yeah. seems like, right? I mean, dude, oh, estrogen out. Estrogen out. <laughs> Too much soy. It's called soy boy, you know what I mean? <laughs> it's like, dude, Doesn't man. believe in discipline. Man, I'm telling you, we should go places. You better not, man. You better not. I, You know, dude, you act a fool like that, my mom, man, come on, dude. <laughs> It's like uh, your kid acting like that, and it's like the mom, and then where's the dude, the dad at? Yeah. Because you know, some parents, I used to coach like all these kids, and some kids would just be wild, and and then their parents would be on the side, and they go, yeah, whatever, you know, yeah. they don't give a shit. You ever and try to just spank parents, them? Some parents just look at their kid like, hey, yeah. mm -hmm. and they'll just look at them, and they go, okay, sorry, and they'll just stop completely. Yeah, yeah. 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 That's, all, that's how it was, right? You, know, you don't you see that know, much anymore. Real, man. You come in here, man, I've seen some people in their, in their parents, and dad's a little dude, but pops ain't no punk. Like, dude, oh, it's my dad, bro. Yeah, yeah. My dad, yeah, I'm like, hey, Best how you doing? Period. So I'm like, okay, yeah, where are you guys going tonight? Okay, man, you guys be on what time? All right. Yeah, man, I mean, there's a respect factor. Don't forget your whip. <laughs> you know? <laughs> <laughs> Can't leave the house without it. Those little Vietnamese dads oh, that are like man. scary as hell, but oh, they're like man. tiny. Yeah. My partner died, he's scared of going to dad. hell a little more. Dad, dad ain't no joke. <laughs> you chop your head or something, man. I mean, chop your head. Ain't no joke, you know? Chop and it, it's big head. families, too. Yeah, yeah, big yeah. family, but all everybody's in line. Ain't no bullshit in there, man. No bullshit. You never hear nobody talk back. Never, bro. That's, mm. I never heard that. But like somebody like said, these dudes, it's just weak dads, weak men. Weak dads, bro. You have a boy, he's weak. weak. Yeah, because you ain't scared of your dad. Oh. Something's wrong. <laughs> you know, and, and the thing you're doing it in public. Yeah. 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 Public display like that, who allows the mm. kids to do that? Like you said, it's like, dude, where's the order at? Bart had a really good dad that was really good at that uh, discipline. <laughs> you beat his ass yeah. to Ethan Allen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Legend says. <laughs> I had a grandfather clock to get away from him. <laughs> he was good. It was good parents. He looked how he turned out. I know. He was a good dad. <laughs> Which one's better? Tra trauma and traumatized with order 
or free and you no know, You know what's no crazy? So my guys beat the fuck out of me, right? And then now like I tell my kid to just like go to timeout or something, right? And he's like, oh, what are you doing? Look how sad he is. <laughs> and, then, and so, my, and so my, my kid is like in the corner, going <coughs> like this, and he'll come with like a tissue and fucking like wipe wipe his tears. I'm like, Dad, you're making him soft. He goes, no, no, no. I'm like, what the fuck? Were you like, where the fuck was that when I needed yeah, it? You said, what yeah. the fuck is going on, dude? That's those grandfather privileges. He could just like, because when, yeah. when he misbehaves, he can just be like, oh, it's your problem now. <laughs> yeah. You, you, know, you know, though, at the end, like you said, though, even like I used to say, like my, in my homeboy said, like sometimes you need to get an ass whooping. Cause you gotta establish a sense of like it's love, but it's respect, and you know that there's a consequence. So it, t it taught you, but at the same time, you're not in prison. You're not running around yeah. doing stupid yeah. shit. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know that there's a value system there that you can go back to. Man, I remember my dad didn't play this shit. You know, so you could fall back on that. Well, you don't have that to fall back on. And these kids who run around right now just having no no sense of a consequence because their dad never whooped that ass. Mm -hmm. And I'm not saying that that's the way that you don't beat your kids, but you have to establish that there's some order and that, man, you know what? I'm not going to mess up because I don't want to have to face my dad. Mm, yeah. Your dad should be Possibly. more scary than police. Yeah. yeah, true. In a way, that is how it was growing up. You didn't care what the principal said, what the teacher said. Just don't call my dad. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I was Wait till dad comes home. I was yeah. happy when the police came at Ethan Allen. I was like, now my dad can't beat my ass. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a ride home. <laughs> <laughs> dad just took off. <laughs>